guys, what's up? Today we are going to West Palm Beach downtown area. We're gonna have some food, some drinks. We're gonna show you guys some of our favorite areas. Eric is just getting ready at the moment, but he's gonna meet us outside and let's get going. You ready? I'm ready. Let's North go. West Palm Beach. Yes. West Palm Beach. Ah, uh, me too. Uh. Hot. Hot. I don't know if we've introduced ourselves even. No. My name's Joanna. I'm Eric. Eric. And we are Joanna and Eric. Alright. Or West Palm Beach has just redid their entire like city city place, city place and I think it's fair enough to show everybody what it looks like. I haven't even seen it. Joanna I did. went the other I day. Went She's like, oh no, my so god. Cool. So, um, but it's been a little bit rainy. We actually, we actually, we actually <laughs> there we go again with my pronunciation. I'm kidding. Um, we have a tropical storm heading our way, or now it's a hurricane officially, right? Hurricane. It's Hurricane Elsa. Yeah, so hopefully. at least it was yesterday. Today is a gorgeous day, a gorgeous day, 95 degrees. Ugh. But hey, it's warm, but you know what? We're wearing our shorts and t shirt, and we're gonna enjoy the heat. Fun. So we're gonna get some food, some drinks, show you around some of our favorite areas, and we're excited. Let's go. Let's roll. They definitely changed up this place. Yeah, it looks so different. For real. When you look at our previous videos, you'll see the one that we did of City Place last time. It was like two and a half years ago. And the area did not look anything like this. This is like super nice. All the kids. So many common areas, shopping, yeah. restaurants to eat. I think I think they really did something good here. I love I love the whole new the whole new vibe. <laughs> Little outdoor bar. We got some of these beautiful little flowers. I love that. Aww. You don't have a coin in your purse? No, I have no coins. You want to get a smoothie? I want to go to that yeah, place. Let's do, let's go. Let's do a smoothie. Okay, we're here. Place. Make a right. It's called Pura Vida. See what, see what, see what the, the scoop is, you know, what looks the best. 
and everything just looked bomb.com. What I got was the Miami Mocha, and it is that espresso banana almond milk, cacao dates, vanilla grass fed wake. Wow. And Joanna got the super green spinach, kale, apple, celery, cucumber, pineapple, ginger, cayenne, lemon, and honey. What's our next destination? We are going to take you guys to Clematis Street, which is also a very popular street here in downtown West Palm Beach. There's a lot of restaurants, bars. We're going to go to Hula Baloo. Hula Baloo. Hula Baloo. Who? What's with all the Hula Baloo? I have no idea what that is. It's an old term. You know, it is like stop with all of that Jerry talk. Whatever. What's Jerry talk? I don't know what that is. So yeah, we'll see you at some added. We, did, we, we knew right away what we wanted this time. It <laughs> take us 30 minutes. So we're gonna get the chicken meatballs. Oh yes. Then we got the tomato fresh mozzarella. mozzarella. Lastly, gnocchi. That's gnocchi what you bolognese. That looks so good. I'm so that, excited for that. I'm excited AF about that. So. Yes. We're sharing everything. Well, she's gonna try to eat my food, but <laughs> we'll see how that turns out. How it always goes. Yeah. Joanna didn't know what it stands for. How the blue stands for all the noise and commotion, which is very, it's, it's matches this restaurant because they're kind of about like the music and the rock stars and they've got a, yeah. lot, of, a lot of like sign, sign paintings and whatnot. So yeah, they've got a lot of, a lot of different arts on the walls, different musicians famous, so. I don't know. It's definitely a place to come check out. Too. You you would normally just walk right past this yeah. place. There's not much signage, there's nothing but walking walk in here my opinion. It's, it's really I don't know, I like Low the I like I the rustic it. kind of vibe. With to the it. white brick. Yeah. The white painted brick. We got the meatballs. We got the salad. And we got the gnocchi. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, it looks so good. Look at that. Not yet. Please, let me start. Yeah, we needed it. I'm just kidding. Wow. It was so good. 10 out of 10 recommend. 10 out of 10 recommend. This thing was like, we devoured this thing. 
this gnocchi was like it was amazing. 10 out of 11, no, 11 out of 10, like, holy crap. Hullabaloo, Clamata Street, 100% recommend. Find it, come to here, and maybe on a cool day, go sit out in the bus and take some good pictures. Come at night, maybe. They, probably, they got lights on the bus, really cute place, really cute little day. So. Next on the itinerary is the... We're going to a distillery in Grandview Market. Look at the big boy, he's all hot. <laughs> big boy, like I want, I want me some water. Okay. Yeah. So... So stay tuned. So we went in there and we got the explanation. Didn't want to film the waitress just because not everybody likes to get filmed. So the down low is they are not a bar yet. They are a distillery which sells liquor yeah. by the bottle, but they do not have a bar license. Yeah. So in order to get around it, they sell you what's called a mocktail. Yeah, a mocktail, which you basically have to buy four tokens worth which is about twenty dollars and they'll give you like a free tasting of the spirit which is like a full shot they give you like a three ounce shot of liquor which, which is the recommended yeah, yeah. The recommended thing for that for, for one mocktail for one mocktail so it's like twenty dollars a shot yeah they're giving you four mocktails and then it's, it's really twenty dollars a shot so for us you know we're budget friendly we're not yeah. here to spend twenty dollars on one on one, one drink on one really? drink when we have to drink four drinks in order to do it you know <laughs> So instead, we walked five steps over to the brewery, the Steam Horse, which is what we are, we walked past, and we're gonna stick with some beers instead. Any drinks? Um, one flight. You had two. One flight and two 62% beers. It wasn't 62%. <laughs> it was eight something percent. We saw a lot of dogs. We saw a lot of babies. I love babies. You know what? I'm guaranteeing you next video 100% Collins is coming with us. And if she doesn't come with us, then you're staying home next time. I'm going out with Collins alone. <laughs> Bring her by myself. Why? Why? Why, why do I have to stay home? Because I love Colin. So we're going to go to South Cove now. Yes, the nature preserve. I don't know what we're going to see there. We asked a couple people about it. They said, what's that? Okay, Where's yeah. that? So we asked some of the locals. Hopefully it's a thing. Hopefully it actually exists. Oh, Cornhole. Our favorite game in the world. So yeah, we'll see you there. There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am holy? Back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Wait, hold on. Put me together.
Take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone Well, after a eventful day Running in the heat Eating some <laughs> delicious food and Italian food Having some good coffee, going to grab a couple beers. I think this little walk here has really finished the day off perfectly. We yeah, get the weather a, is so nice. It's just it's maybe in the 80s, but it there's a breeze, so it feels good. There's a breeze. Really nice. This is like the perfect end of day walk. So you get the nice little nature scene. You get it's it's just so serene, so it quiet. It is peaceful, so quiet. Yeah, so. Nice. That pretty much does it for our day, you know. Yeah, we hopefully. went to Madis Street, we went to City Place, we went to Grandview Market, and now we're here at South, South Cove Park Nature Preserve. So if you're ever in the area, these are definitely really great spots to hit up. Mm -hmm. um, it gets yeah. you all, it gets you away from all the hullabaloo. <laughs> All the commotion, all, all the commotion. Next week, I am going to Boston, so I'm really excited to kind of vlog that experience and share it with you guys. Eric won't be there, unfortunately. Must, but... must stay behind on this one, unfortunately. <laughs> but if you like this video, please hit that thumbs button, thumbs up button, and subscribe for weekly uploads. And we'll see you guys next time. Yeah, see you guys next time. Have a great, great time. Love y'all. Goodbye. Cue the music. <laughs> wow, goodbye. Oh, the fuck is